This episode of WasteToWatch.com is brought to you by GameStop. GameStop offers the best in games and hardware. Go to WasteToWatch.com forward slash GameStop to see their latest offers. Hi everyone, this is Lawrence for WasteToWatch.com. This is the unboxing and review of the Vizio S3820W soundbar. The Vizio S3820W soundbar is their entry level product. It costs about $100. How good can it be for $100? The Vizio S3820W includes the 3.5mm to RCA audio cable, the digital coaxial cable, the remote control, the optical digital audio cable, and the soundbar speaker. The Vizio soundbar has adequate build quality. The front is nearly all speaker cloth. Along the bottom edge, there's a line of silver plastic, and at the very bottom edge, it's a line of glossy plastic. There are four ways to send audio to the Vizio S3820W soundbar. There's a RCA connection, an eighth inch jack, a digital coaxial, and a digital optical connection. The S3820W includes Bluetooth. This feature is great for connecting tablets, smartphones, and other devices. Pairing my iPhone and iPad to it was really easy. When I connected the S3820W to my television, I was pleasantly surprised by the sound quality. It does the basic job of delivering better sound to a television. Dialogue was crisp and clear, and the sound overall was balanced. The bar is lacking when it comes to bass. For good skin vibrating bass, you will want to add an external subwoofer using the available subwoofer connection. The Vizio S3820W's included remote is well made. It feels really firm in my hand. The back of the remote is made of a smooth plastic and the front is aluminum. The S3820W's price is really affordable, but this soundbar doesn't offer anything special. If you are looking to improve your audio at a bare minimum, the Vizio S3820W has you covered. But if you want true surround sound, you will need to shop for a better soundbar or sound system. It is currently priced a little bit below $100 from Target.com. If you like this video, subscribe and click the like button below. For the full review, check out our article at Waste2Watch.com. This is Lawrence for Waste2Watch.com. I'll see you soon.